teacher nurses. So today I will be demonstrating about flower arrangement. So first I will introduce myself. I am April K. P. Benagades, a student nurse from Foundation University. So let's start. But first, what is the purpose of flower arrangement? It enhances the color of the surrounding. It gives aesthetic appearance to the environment. Lastly, it promotes the patient well-being through manipulation of milieu. For the assessment, we must assess for any allergies to pollens or fresh flowering plants. Then, we must review the patient's records for any contraindication of placing flower inside the room. Also, we must check for any procedure or treatment the patient is undergoing that compromises the immune system. For nursing diagnosis, we must determine the related factors that could influence the environment. The appropriate nursing diagnosis may include first is the risk for infection, second is the risk for injury, and the third is the altered immune response. So for the planning, we must determine the equipment needed, perform hand washing, review the methods of the different kinds of flower arrangement, and then gather the materials essential for the procedure. Gather all the equipments needed. The equipment that is needed in this procedure is the water, the flowers, and of course the vase. Before we start, this ethic alcohol right here is used for hand hygiene. Let us first perform hand hygiene as per planning to save time and detect the transmission of microorganisms from one surface to another. hand hygiene you can start the procedure and then please select the four varied types of arrangement first thing you need to do is pour enough water on the base it can refresh the flowers for how many days it takes I may use the mixed type of the arrangement, a varied kind of flower that enhances the color of the surrounding. Discard the part of the flower that has been cut off like stem and fallen petals. Wipe off water dripping extremely out of the vase. When you are done the procedure, again perform hand hygiene to reduce the transmission of microorganisms.
all done thank you for watching